Ladies and beautiful people, and welcome back to another Attack on Titan OST reaction video. So, if you're new here and you don't know what's going on, all of you are deciding which OSTs, which openings, which endings I should react to from Attack on Titan. We're currently doing a journey, checking out all the full opening songs, all the full ending songs, and all the full OSTs. So put in the comment section down below which video you would like me to record next. And also, keep in mind that a bunch of you have been asking me to record the OVAs, so if you want one of them next, Put your recommendation in the comment section down below. Whichever video you all recommend the most, you all upvote the most in that comment section will be the one I record next. But for now, easily the most requested one for me to record a reaction to next is this one right here, Attack on Titan OST, Vogel and Kethish. Now let me know if I pronounce that right in the comment section down below. I'm going to stop talking and jump straight into this reaction to Attack on Titan OST, Vogel and Kethish. OST for Attack on Titan is just fucking incredible. Literally, it plays goosebumps instantly. And my mind is just sucked straight back into the show and all the darkness that lies within this show and just all the epicness that lies within this show. Absolutely mind blowing. This is the version that you all told me I needed to react to uh, the remastered epic sound quality version. I can already see why. This is awesome. <laughs> Straight back there. I so nearly started this again the other night. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to. I was literally, it was like late at night, and my wife was like, What should we watch? And I was like, Attack on Titan. And she was like, If you want to watch it, put it on. And the thing is, I don't know if you guys, anyone who's in a relationship will know this. Your partner, there's times when they're awake and ready for something, and times when they're not. Okay? Like, I know what certain TV shows to put on at certain times, like something more lighthearted and easy if it's late at night, right? And I knew if I put on Attack on Titan as much as I wanted to, she wasn't going to properly take it in. It was, it was late. It was approaching midnight. She was going to be tired. And she wasn't probably going to take it in. So I had to make the ultimate decision to not put it on. And man, it killed me because I really wanted to watch it again. But I'm telling you right now, that day is coming. My wife's first anime reaction. Well, not reaction, but first time watching anime. This, this, I think You See Me Big Girl is my favorite Attack on Titan OST so far, but this one, this one is fucking awesome. It's so good. What's everyone's favorite Attack on Titan OST? And what's your favorite moment? There might be spoilers in the comment section. Just saying, beware. If you haven't seen the show yet. Wow. 
guys, we gotta wait till like fucking October or something. Ah. <laughs> Ah, oh, do you know what though? I keep thinking we have to wait till October to get Attack on Titan coming back. But once it's back, we have one episode and it is gone forever. We will never have that feeling of waiting for an episode. This is the only time I'm ever going to have it. But it'll be gone. That'll be it. No more. They must. They, uh, is there a spin-off show they're going to do? There must be something, right? They could. Do, surely, there's like a million stories they could explore. I mean, it depends how they end it. But ah, oh, man, I'm going to be kind of sad. <laughs> This is definitely one of my favorite OSTs, definitely. This this one is incredible. Um, absolutely incredible. Oh, it's so fucking epic. Just cruise bumps the whole time. I can't wait to watch this show again, man. I can't wait. I can't wait. It's so funny. Every now and then, I just see people in the comment section going, you should record your reaction to the, <laughs> to the first episode again. And it's like, at this point, my channel would just become a, a reaction channel that just rewatches Attack on Titan. <laughs> and we're back. Hey, welcome back to another reaction video. We're watching episode one of Attack on Titan again uh, for the ninth time. Like, I can't do that. I did actually ask my wife if she wanted to do... Because my wife's never seen an anime, right? Same as me, like, less than a year ago. I had no interest in anime. Same as my wife. She has no interest in anime. And then you guys sucked me down that damn rabbit hole. And I've been here ever since. And, um... And, yeah, my, my wife, like... When I was, like, coming down and talking about Attack on Titan... I'd never spoil anything for her. But I'd come down and I'd be like... Oh, my God, that episode was amazing. And the more I kept doing that... The more she kept getting sold on the idea of watching it. And eventually I was like would you like to watch it? And she was like, yes. So my wife does actually want to watch Attack on Titan. Um, but I asked her, she's done, she's done reaction videos with me before. And I asked her if she'd want to do one. And she said she'd rather sit down, watch it and just enjoy it without any pressure of having to a camera on her. My wife's not like me. I don't care. If the camera's on, it's the same as if it's off. Like I'm the same with my wife downstairs as I am with you guys. I'm just the same. You meet me in real life, you'll see. I'm literally just the same guy. Um, it, it's easy for me. It's not so much, it's not easy for her. Um, when the camera comes on, she finds it a bit awkward and stuff. She's done very warm reactions before, but I think she really wants to just experience it without any, that, any kind of that stuff. Sit down and experience her first watch along without that. So I have spoken to her about it. I know if I really wanted her to, she would, um, re we, she would do, we could do a double reaction when she watches it. But I honestly think she'd just sit there in silence and take it all in. Um, so yeah, I, I think, I think we're just going to rewatch it ourselves. Um, hopefully that's not a disappointment to all of you. I really want her to just enjoy the show and not have to worry about you guys right there. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, oh that's such a good one, that one. <clears throat> how many OSTs are there? Like, how many like this? How many ones are there? Because there's tons of, like, hour and a half long Attack on Titan OSTs. But how many like this? How many more have we got? One of, I think one of you has actually listed them all out, right? What do you guys want next? What's the next OST we're checking out? Because there are tons to check out. Or do you guys want me to do a reaction to a full opening or ending? I can do that as well. Or do you guys want an OVA next? And if so, which one? This is basically like the Attack on Titan journey of like finishing it all now. That's what we're doing. We finished the whole show and we're finishing, we're wrapping it up. We're finishing it all. So we're going to do a reaction to all the full openings, all the full endings. We're going to do a reaction to all the OSTs individually. And we're going to do a reaction to all the OVAs. And you guys just get to decide what comes next. In that comment section and i'll keep reading the comments and seeing what you all vote for and we'll just keep going until we finish it all that's the plan um so go to that comment section right now and put something down there i'm really excited to explore all of this because even though you watch the show you never kind of really take in the full ost so it's nice to sit down and just listen to the full version of something you just hear in the background of amazing scenes and then just relive those scenes in your mind ah 
it, it, this this anime is just cheating. It's, it really is. I never thought. I never thought I'd like anime ever. I really didn't. I never thought it was going to be anything I would enjoy, anything I'd like. I I I was one of those people. One of those people. I don't know if there's a word for them. But I was one of those people who was like, anime, nah, it's for kids. It's for young people. It's not for me. Blah blah blah. And I sat down and watched Attack on Titan. I was like, it's not for kids. <laughs> I was like, this is a. Uh, this is this has been messed up, and the rest is history. And now what we're doing a watch along of Made in Abyss. Uh, we're about to finish Helsing Ultimate. We've watched that time I got reincarnated as a slime. We've watched Konosuba now, which we've caught up on as well. We've watched Cyberpunk Edge Runners. Um, it's been a lot of fun. It has been a lot of fun, and I'm enjoying every single step of the journey. And you guys taking me down this rabbit hole. It's been a lot of fun, and we just keep going down more and more rabbit holes that I never thought I'd explore. And I'm just having the best time. I hope you guys are still really enjoying these reactions and enjoying this journey with me as much as I'm enjoying taking it. I mean, we've only been doing YouTube, what, what is it now? Like um, 14, 15 months? So it's still a baby channel. It's, it's been a lot of fun. Anyway, I love all of you wonderful people. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Make sure you press that subscribe button if you did. And as always, my friends, you right there will see me in the next video.